Welcome to the complete podcast. Today, we're discussing steps to take after your personal information is compromised in a data breach. Because, as Jeremy Wanamaker, CEO of Complete Network says, preventing cyber threats is key, but you also need a solid action plan to minimize damage if they do occur. Hackers may use your data to open new lines of credit, file false tax claims, or even access healthcare services. If you've been affected, the first thing to do is assess what was stolen. For example, usernames and passwords are less sensitive, while social security numbers and credit card details are highly sensitive. After identifying the severity, take immediate action, change your passwords, especially for affected accounts, and activate two-factor authentication wherever possible. Stay informed about the breach by following updates from the company involved. Reducing your online presence and freezing your credit are also effective ways to limit further exposure. If your data is being actively used for fraud, file a police report. While law enforcement may not resolve the issue directly, having an official record can help when working with banks or credit agencies. Finally, it's important to always perform regular checks on your financial statements and credit reports for unusual activity. Practice good cyber hygiene by using strong passwords, enabling two-factor authentication, and keeping your software up to date. If you want to learn more about protecting yourself after a data breach, read the full article on our website. And don't forget to add us to your Spotify playlist for more expert insights.